Hello, my good friends. Uh, just a uh, part that Timmy's here. Uh, I'm using uh, Brad Sawyer's uh, camera that he, he sold to me. Uh, uh, I work with uh, Brad Sawyer. He's no relation to Tom Sawyer. <laughs> um, just having a nice cappuccino. And, uh, well, it's really hot out there. Uh, here's, here, here's what it looks like outside. And, uh, yeah, uh, um, Oh yeah, okay. I want to see uh, uh, hi to my. Uh, okay, I'm not friends with her, but uh, she's a friend of my friend Zazie and Spin, and uh, a friend of Kelly's too, I guess. Uh, her name's uh, Ellie Cat. Uh, <laughs> she's in uh, Aussie uh, with with my uh, my friends, and uh, 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 oh yeah, okay. Speaking of friends, on Spin, I uh, I did have 140 until uh, today. How did you take that goop all off? Oh my god. I didn't know he was that bad. Uh, that last one he did. Yeah. Well, uh, yeah, see, I, I mentioned I did that in a blog on spin, so uh, pretty much everybody knows what's going on there. But uh, yeah, I took him off uh, Facebook too. Uh, Anti everything. Oh, oh, yeah, okay, so um, when I met him in uh, Calgary. We were sitting at the uh, the fish place that's, um, yeah, I, forget the, I forget the name of it. They have really good fish at one time. That's where I get fish all the time for me and Jeanette. And uh, that's when we lived in Marlboro. I was living with Jeanette all the time. And, and he, like if he, if he was going to be anywhere near like what he's been like for the last week, uh, I would have known. And <laughs> I didn't know. But he was like going on. Right line about immigrants and uh, into into this, into that, and oh, now you got into this, the the Orlando shooting thing. Oh, boy. no, that was enough. Wait, okay. Speaking of the Orlando shooting, okay, um, that's very likely going to get Trump in. That that one alone. That's because um, o Obama's uh, pointing fingers at uh, the Republicans, and he, yeah, he never mentioned terrorists or Muslims or nothing. Nothing like that. No, they they tell them not to. Well, um, uh, that that guy there, the guy the Orlando shooting guy. I don't know. I don't know what what the deal was there. But no, they didn't look good for Democrats. Uh, I don't think they're getting in. <laughs> um, oh yeah. Okay. So the um, uh, trying like the gun the gun talk always comes up. Okay. So. You're gonna ban all the guns. Every gun? My sister says, why don't you just shut down the gun makers? Well, that's fine. But you, you, you know how many guns would be pouring in from other countries? A Africa mainly? Oh, lots. Lots. And it and, uh, uh, wasn't very long ago. Um, the 9-11. Uh, uh, okay, uh, I was living in Michigan. I couldn't get across for like two weeks. The, the border was just backed up too much. Then finally, uh, get coming over, and then, then when I came back across, there was like three guys parked at each booth. Each booth had like, there was like four or five booths open. Three guys at each one. Each one uh, automatic weapons. <laughs> three. Uh, I says the ex girlfriend. I said this costs money. Uh, and she goes, Yeah, that's what they're trying to do. Um, just uh, trying to make America so messed up that it just can't afford to run anymore. Uh, you already took down 9-11, uh, uh, the Twin Towers. Um, last time we checked, America is still standing. Uh, and they're, they're going to be there. Like, I... <laughs> um, oh yeah, so... So, um, um, so you sh shut down the gun, the gun makers. And yeah, the, the ex-girlfriend and his sister, um, yeah, when I was crossing, uh, and they had all these guards, there's guys crossing and trying to bring, bring dope in. And I says, why would they do that when they know there's guards? And she goes, uh, it beats me. And I says, I think it's because you, and, and there's there's all kinds of spares that are willing to do this all for the cause. They, they know they're going to get caught, so they're going to do it anyway. And if you send in 10 guys and one gets through, there you go. That's, and, 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 and it's no different than, say, uh, here at Timmy's. You make uh, two dozen donuts, uh, 
a dozen of them, maybe 15, get sold in a day. So the rest get thrown out. You 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 made those. You you know you know there's going to be bad ones getting getting tossed out. And, and apparently it's 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 no different. So so the uh, the guns coming in. You send in ten guys, or ten shipments. Nine of them get caught. You got one that just went through. And they're going to keep on doing it. it, it it's a supply and demand. If it, if and and it's going to turn uh, good people into bad people. And and guess who's working? The lawyers. The lawyers are like, oh, this is a this is a field day for us. We're going to turn all these good people into bad people. So now they're going to have every good person is. Uh, when before you had a legal gun, now you don't have a legal gun. That's 300 million people with illegal guns versus, I don't know how many have legal now, but you won't be legal anymore. That's that's a, a bonus. I mean, th those guys are working like, like there's no tomorrow. I mean, they're not losing. The the, the average Joe is losing. Yeah, sure, sure. The, uh, the, 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 the oh, and it, I, I used to uh, beat, beat my friend on a spin in uh, Facebook. I said, yeah, I agree. These uh, assault, uh, assault weapons are very, uh, <laughs> they're making making things look pretty bad. But, you know, being in Michigan, they, uh, they uh, or any, well, even Texas, they're, they're going to agree. Um, you take these away and then you're going to work on something else and then you're going to work on something else like that and soon it won't be anymore. And that's what they're afraid of. You're going to turn good people into bad ones. And, uh, <laughs> Uh, uh, oh, and, and, and uh, Democrats over in, in, in the U.S. kind of make, make uh, Republicans they point the finger at them, saying, "No, it's your fault." And <laughs> uh, plus, plus the uh, not only the bad guys who still have guns, the, the government's going to have guns, so they're going to make it so they, they, the average Joe can't have a gun. Oh uh, no, 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 that, that's not going to work. Uh, like even here, they they make it so hard to hard to get a gun, and you're like, well, what else are you gonna do? Well, you're gonna have to set traps at your your place. You're gonna have to if somebody breaks into your place. What do you do? Well, you're gonna have to grab a baseball bat, and ho hopefully they don't have a gun. Hopefully they don't have a gun. Well, in my place, you break in. Uh, well, we got the dog, so take, and it's kind of old. So if you take out the dog, well, you got me. Uh, my nine iron still works pretty good, so one bash up across the head. Yeah, I think you're gonna be hurting. <laughs> that, that, that's uh, providing. Well, even if you, you do have a gun, I'm still, I'm still swinging. Uh, anyway, uh, okay, yeah, I gotta go ahead over um, get some uh, eggs, milk. I'm gonna watch a movie. Oh, the movie's called uh, Housewife from Hell. Ron Jeremy's in this one, so you know it's gonna be a burn burger. Uh, anyway, okay. And uh, all my friends in uh, Spin and Facebook, uh, you rock.